Let's talk about fix and flips. That has become a very popular thing here in the real estate market. More than 407,000 homes were flipped in 2022, which was a 14% increase from the previous year and a 58% increase from 2020. But increasing mortgage rates and increasing cost and the banking crisis this year have meant that there's a fall off in the return on investment for these flippers. So there's a lot less liquidity now for a fix and flip. If they're buying a home and they're gonna have to take out even short-term financing on it, they're gonna have to keep that financed while they're rehabbing the property, mm -hmm. they're having to pay for the renovations, they're having to pay the holding time for that house to be on the market. And at the end of the day, the profit margins are not what they were back in like 2021 when every house it seemed went into a bidding war. Your profit is just a lot less on those fix and flip homes. So we're seeing a lot less of them right now because of the higher interest rates on the mortgage. You can't put X number of dollars into a house, even if you get it under contract at that price, if it doesn't appraise, then that can create a problem. Probably the last half of 2022, when the mortgage rates started going up, you had to be real specific in looking at comparative market data for just like the past 30 to 60 days instead of taking a six month history because the values were changing that quickly. A house that you put on the market that might have sold at 250 back in 2021 with higher interest rates and all that kind of stuff, you may have to price it lower than the 250 you could have got at the height of the market. So right now we are kind of seeing a slowdown on fix and flips. If it's a ma and pa, they're only doing maybe three or four flips a year. I don't know that it's really affected them as much because most of them are just reinvesting that money onto the next purchase. But for companies who are doing this as a scaled operation, I think a lot of them are seeing a slowdown and not putting as many homes out there because of the increased mortgage rate. What are you seeing in your fix and flip market? Do you think that we're getting more homes on the market that have been flipped? Do you think the quality of the flips are as good as they used to be? Let me know what your thoughts are in the comments.